you trying to show me, trying to get me mad, like, oh, no, oh, let me show you the thing. Let me show you my DM. Uh -huh, I'm going to hurt her feelings. I don't care. I don't care. That does not be hitting. That you still calling my shit. Trying to get, trying to get your lick back. Trying to do your big lick back. I don't care. You're lame. And this is lame too. You want to know why? Because you got to this in order to get your ego to feel high. Cardi B and Offset are in the middle of a wild public feud that's got fans in social media buzzing. It all kicked off with some serious accusations of cheating and things got heated during an Instagram live session where both artists threw shade at each other. So here's the scoop. Offset accused Cardi of cheating on him while she was pregnant with their third kid, dropping the bombshell line, you effed with a baby inside, tell the truth. It's no fun when I'm slanging pee, right? Hmm. You know what I find so crazy? That a nigga think that they could just buy a bitch. You know what I'm saying? And I, and it's so crazy that a nigga think that that's enough. It's not enough, honey. It's just not enough. I'm moving on. Move on. Move on. Why can't you move on? Why can't you move on? This really ramped up the drama between them and shocked a lot of fans. Cardi fired back denying his claims and showing her frustration. She bluntly said, I don't care, about his actions and stressed that she's always been too good for him. Cardi also admitted she regrets their relationship but acknowledged that Offset is a good daddy to their kids. You know, I'm too much, I'm too, I'm too, I'm too much woman for you. You know what I'm saying? I'm too much of a boss for you. And I always been too good for you. I've been too good for you. I've been too good for anything that is associated to you. So you gotta f just to make yourself feel better, because I make you feel so low about yourself. Because I don't make you feel like I'm you're the in this home. So that's what you gotta do. So you out here trying to hurt my feelings because the next bitch. I don't give a. F I don't give. Because them hoes ain't being good enough that I be having you crashing out. All weekend, you was mad happy today when I called you today. And the only reason why I got I, I called you today is because I'm trying to change my son's school and I need your approval. Other than that, you, I don't care. World, I'm your ops. Uh, that's what ops. Yeah, of course, because you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't move with integrity. You're not a street. That's what you do. That's what you do. Oh, I'm gonna go ops. Go, go, go. Boo hoo, nigga. I don't give a. You could ops. You. My friends, nigga, I don't give a shit. The back and forth didn't stop there. Cardi even confirmed Offset's cheating accusations with a cheeky tweet that simply said, and did. This response left fans buzzing and speculating about what it all means. Offset is hinted at possibly taking legal action against Cardi if things escalate, suggesting he might go after some assets in their divorce. Cardi isn't backing down though, saying she'll fight for what she's earned. Now, that's a lot to take in, but let's call it as it is. Their relationship has been a roller coaster since they got hitched in 2017. From then until today, they have three kids together and have split and gotten back together quite a few times. Cardi even filed for divorce in August 2024, but she welcomed their third child shortly after. Now, let's get into the nitty gritty of what happened the other day between these two former lovebirds. During some Instagram lives on Wednesday night, Cardi accused Offset of blowing up her phone, trying to make her jealous since he's apparently moving on. She even said she regrets ever getting into a relationship with him. Although she didn't name him directly, it was clear she was talking about Offset. While she was in France for Paris Fashion Week, Cardi made it clear she does not care about any other women in Offset's life. Life. That's why she insisted and said things like, I'm too much woman for you over and over again. She said and most agree that she was always too good for him. At another point in her live stream, she said, nothing surprises me anymore. You've done it all, so I don't care. But she did thank him for their kids, saying she doesn't regret any of them, just him. You're a good daddy. You're all right, she added. Cardi also mentioned that she doesn't want anything bad to happen to Offset because their kids love him, saying, I really follow street codes. So what are people saying about Cardi? She's done done. I believe she gave her best to stay married to him. She wanted to be outside. Well, he can enjoy the weather. And other people said, Offset cheating so many times, I don't blame her. 
she tired. Cardi is on a whole new vibe now. After all this time, she now feels like she's got nothing to lose, and she doesn't. The relationship with Offset is done and dusted, and at this point, most will agree. There's just no way that they will get back together. Cardi has had it with all the drama, and now it's Offset's turn to face the music. When a woman is done, there's really no stopping her, and everyone can see that when Cardi talks like this, she's seriously over it all. And here's where it gets juicy. Cardi's asking for full custody of their three kids. Culture, who's six, Wave, who's three, and their newborn who just came into the world on September 7th. Even though things are getting chaotic, they've had some decent moments lately. Offset was at Wave's birthday party and even showed up for the birth of their latest child. Cardi and Offset have just grown apart over time. Cheating wasn't even the main reason she decided to file for divorce. That's just what pushed her to make this decision. This thing was falling apart for years. Plus, let's not forget Cardi tried to file for divorce back in 2020 but ended up having a change of heart. Based on all that we've heard from this and the previous rants it sounds like he's seeing someone else and cardi's like i don't care about them she makes it clear he's not worth her time anymore she even said she's only called him to discuss their son's school situation and other than that she's completely over him they're no longer on the same side cardi called him out for not acting like a real man and she's just fed up with all his games one thing that cardi tried quite hard to show and prove to others is that she does not regret having a family with offset she only regrets him he was the thing that disappointed her the most all these years of trying to make it work and he just couldn't change his ways it's really a shame to see. They were quite the power couple. Nonetheless, she loves her kids and has no regrets about having them. She wrapped up her rant by saying she didn't want to air out their dirty laundry on social media, but since Offset is being messy, she's ready to match his energy. If he wants to play games, she'll play him right back. In this rant, Cardi B is really letting it all out about how frustrated she is with Offset. She feels disrespected and is just tired of his antics. It's clear she sees herself as better than him now and isn't going to let him drag her down. She's all about empowerment, showing that she won't let Offset's actions affect her. Instead of being sad, she's taking back her voice and letting him know she's done with the drama. Overall, Cardi B's rant shows her strength and independence. She's standing up for herself and making it clear she's ready to move on. It's a real moment that anyone who's been through a tough breakup can relate to, making her both inspiring and down to earth. Cardi B and Offset's relationship has been nothing short of a roller coaster, full of drama, scandals, and enough tea to keep fans talking for years. The cheating rumors and messy moments between them haven't just shaken up their personal lives, but also sent shockwaves to the hip-hop scene. Their drama hits on some big topics like trust, infidelity, and the ups and downs of living life in the spotlight. The whole cheating thing has been a recurring theme ever since these two got together. It all started back in 2017, not long after they made things official. Offset got caught up in a scandal when a video surfaced showing him in a hotel room with another woman. That was just the beginning of a long list of messy situations. By early 2018, things got worse, with rumors of a sex tape featuring Offset making the rounds. Cardi even addressed some of it in their now-deleted post, making it clear just how much she was struggling with the drama. Despite everything, they kept getting back together even after Cardi announced they were splitting in December 2018 following more cheating allegations. Fast forward to the latest drama where we found out that Cardi cheated while she was pregnant with their third child. Cardi's blunt comeback and did basically confirmed she wasn't denying it, adding more chaos to their already wild relationship. Their constant public back and forth have turned their personal issues into a whole soul opera for everyone to watch. The ups and downs of Cardi and Offset's relationship haven't just stayed between them. It's had a big impact on hip-hop culture, especially around how infidelity is viewed. Their saga is a mix of both a cautionary tale and a guilty pleasure for fans. In hip-hop, relationships full of drama, passion, and conflict are often glorified, and Cardi and Offset fit that mold perfectly. Their ability to mix their personal issues with their music has kept them in the spotlight, even when dealing with serious stuff like trust and loyalty. It makes you wonder if this normalizes cheating in hip-hop and whether it's setting the right example for fans who look up to them. While Cardi and Offset are undeniably successful, their relationship doesn't exactly scream couple goals. The constant cycle of accusations and makeups has some people questioning what kind of message they're really sending. Some critics say their public drama is sending mixed signals about love and commitment. Instead of showing a strong, healthy relationship based on trust and respect, their story often highlights betrayal and emotional chaos. As major figures in hip-hop world, they're under the microscope for not setting the best example for younger fans who might idolize them. As Cardi and Offset continue to figure out their complicated relationship, their messy scandals are impacting more than just their lives. The drama is playing out for all to see and stirring up conversation throughout hip-hop culture. Their story is both entertaining and a reminder of how fame, love, and betrayal can get real messy. While their drama keeps fans hooked, it's also worth thinking about what kind of messages their ups and downs are sending to the world, especially when it comes to relationships.